So over the last week I have been grinding out the T32 and we have now got the second mark. Hopefully in this episode we should be able to raise maybe 2% if we're lucky, get it to around about 87, that's a target. And then hopefully by next week we should have free marked this tank and we can move on to the M103. Either way, let us begin the gaming. Okay, so we are on Tundra and I am going to go to the left hand side because I have not had a good experience with the hill upon recent memories. Um, yes, hill equals bad, at least recently. I mean, if you're in a slow tank, hill definitely equals bad because you get at least one shot taken when you cross and then you will kind of just be sitting there getting bombarded by artillery. I mean, you get bombarded by artillery this side as well, but it's uh, it's not as nice as this side, at least. And plus, you can play hull down over here. So even though there's a Skoda 256 coming this way, um, it's not really too much of a problem as long as we can just stay hold down we should be good and we'll also see what else is over this way so there is a phase one coming as well and that's a 419 with stun from artillery very very balanced no issues whatsoever with artillery in this game Uh, we still have a Patriot behind us, which is very, very good for us. And this IS-5 is a little bit clueless. I don't know what he's doing. 319 this time. Lovely. That's what you want to see. There we go. Put one into him as well. Hide the Capola with our gun as best as we can. You know, he just hits it anyway. That's completely fine. We'd like to get this, uh, this scope out of the game. <laughs> okay. Yes, critical hit. As you can tell, very, very critical as he is, uh... Um, okay, well, we're dead. I'll get this scope out of the game. At least before I die, hopefully. I mean, either way, if I don't die to the Pajetto, I'm going to die to the uh, artillery in a second. Let's see if we can get one shot out on this phase one. And now it's just about getting as much damage as we can. Oh, okay. He didn't actually shoot me, which is surprising. Alright, well, I know the Ice 5 is going to peek me and kill me here, but there we go. Try and hide that. Nah. I was too focused with the IS-5. We could have got one more shot out on the a, a, uh, Progetto. Let me get some spotting, so it's not too bad in 3k combined. Yeah, imagine if artillery wasn't in that game. Would have been great, wouldn't it? Remember, artillery prevents camping. Clearly I was camping in that game. You know? I should have played arty safe. Well, we lost. Uh, we come second on damage. And we died within 2 minutes to 52 seconds. But we're now on Outpost. Beautiful map. The bigger version of mines. Yes. Well, we're going to go to the heavy corner and we'll hope for the best. Our SU-101 is pushing very, very aggressively there. Oh, that is very aggressive. There's also no artillery, which makes me very, very happy indeed. You know what? Since the SU-101 is pushing, we should all just push. Like, that's just what we should do. You know, if this guy's going for it, we should just back him up and just, uh, see if we can get done out of it. Hmm, that is a, uh, an annoying tank to deal with. A tank that I can't really pen. Like, at all, unless I'm around the side or the rear of him. At least our team's coming forwards. This is really good. Oh. I need to shoot the lower plate. Don't. Are you gonna peek again? Cannot pen the lower plate, apparently. Lovely. I'm 
mean, I could go down where the AMX is, to be fair. There we go. Get a shot on the lower plate, finally. I'm going to see if I can go down where the AMX is. I'm going to see if I can go uh, hold down here. Oh my god, this does not turn very well in water. We'll cross straight over to get behind these houses. We know that there's a guard up there. We know. One into the 7032. Don't have shots on him. Let's try and side scrape a little bit if we can. There's also that BZ-176 up there, which is going to be very annoying for me to deal with. Looks like he might be able to peek this side in a second. And he's not using HP boost, so... It's fine. We'll get the spotting. And load HE. HE for the scorpion if we can. You're gonna be pushing. Of course we don't hit it. And that SU 101 has now run off. Wonderful. Just what we want. He's coming around behind, it's fine. The ISU is down here, facing me right now. I mean, I can maybe try and bait the shot into my tracks. I can't go forwards though, because of the Scorpion. Oh, this is just awful. Okay. Uh, well, I don't know what to say. Like, <laughs> yep. Welcome to Outpost. Very good map. Yes. Well, it's now time for Live Oaks in lovely, lovely tier 10 matchmaking. I can't wait. 277 coming this side is actually quite surprising. Is, you know, he doesn't have gun depression to really play on a ridge line or anything like that. But he has made a rather big mistake. One that hopefully we can punish him for. Alright. Oh, that was fun. You really over peeking this just to kill me? Well, I didn't expect a Cobra to be able to shoot me. That's actually a... Uh, that's actually an insanely hard shot to hit for the Cobra. I mean, I've struggled to do that in an STLV. Why are you YOLOing? Blacklist him to be aware next time. And um, we're just going to wait to be unspotted now. I really didn't expect everyone to overpeak just to shoot. Honestly. Hopefully, we can get some revenge on this uh, Centurion. Not quite. Where's this going? That was, like, directly on him. I must have hit someone else, surely. <laughs> there we go. Surely I hit someone else there. But, unfortunately, this game... ...really didn't go well for us. Really, really didn't go well for us. Like, at all. 
and we are gonna be dropping marks because of it. Man, I don't know. Like, I'm just not allowed to do damage, apparently. Penetration. What is that there? Oh, the gorilla. Well, I mean, what can you do? What can you do? The enemy team were just completely useless. As I said, like, right at the start, like, why is a 277 coming over here? He has no gun depression to play on the ridge line, even if he survives that. Wait, it's really dumb. No, I mean, we won. <laughs> well, I mean, we end up going down in marks. So, that went well. I don't know. I'm I'm now at the stage where we've played 64 games. 2.4k average. Like, we're playing at, like, you know, 3k average-ish. But, like, I'm so bored of the tank. Like, <laughs> I just want to move up to the 103. And now I'm going to get bored of that very, very quickly. Because that is not a good tier 9. Also next season we are definitely um, using food. I'll, I'll keep the you know the no gold that's fine but definitely using food because this is just like why would you do that to yourself there's no reason to not use food. Anyway that's going to be the grind we got lovely 33% win rate very nice and 1.8k average damage very very good indeed see you in the next one